Hi, my name is Anita Wallace. I'm chair of the Lymphedema Support Network. And I'm delighted to introduce you to someone that I've worked with for scarily nearly 20 years, uh, Professor Peter Mortimer. He's the LSN's chief medical advisor and leading lymphedema specialist both here in the UK and overseas. So this person um, would like to ask what further treatment can be offered? For instance, I know some places you can have dye injected into your hand and the lymph nodes show up, identifying the blockage, or in other countries offer lymph transfer. So my question is, how can new and recent innovations impact on my care? Okay, I think the patient is uh, talking about the, the, the newer uh, lymphatic microsurgery techniques that have been introduced around the world. I think that's where they're coming from. Uh, for example, uh, there is one operation called LVA, which stands for lymphaticovendular anastomosis. And that involves joining up uh, a blocked or a, uh, where a lymphatic is blocked, joining it upstream of the blockage to a vein to allow the lymph to drain. And to do that operation, they need to put the dye into the hand or the foot uh, the, uh, to, to be able to see the lymph vessels, not necessarily to identify the blockage. So um, I think that's where the, the dye issue comes in. And the, that, so that operation is not available on the NHS. It's done by uh, a number of centres in the UK, but the one with the most experience in my view is the Oxford Lymphedema Practice, and they do it quite a lot. Um, and that has been a useful development uh, in the treatment of certain forms of lymphedema. Not everyone's suitable for no. it. No, no. You might have to do the dye test to find out if you're a suitable candidate or not. Uh, the other operation uh, is and is referred to here is a lymph node transfer. So what that means is that, for example, a breast cancer patient who's had lymphedema uh, has had lymph nodes removed from one armpit can have a healthy lymph node removed from uh, some other part of the body to put in the armpit which has now lost its lymph glands and this surgery uh, is still I think being evaluated in terms of success. Yes it makes sense to do it but only in certain forms of lymphedema and I think one of the issues is the patient selection for that type of operation um, has not been as good as it should be. But there aren't, there isn't so much experience in the UK of that operation. No, no. It was pioneered in France and America. But as to how successful it is, I think the jury's still out. Thank you very much, Peter.